Hello everyone, this is Dr. C and this is How to Use PowerPoint Insert Ribbon 1. The Insert Ribbon <clears throat> has a variety of options on it and we're looking at in the left where the red arrow is pointing the Insert Picture, picture option and then we're going to look at the Insert a Text Box. Well first, <clears throat> let's get out of here and we'll go to a new slide and we're first going to insert a picture. Now we could do it by selecting that little icon and clicking on it or I'll undo that. Go to the insert, go to picture, see it in the upper left and same thing. There's a different picture, right? <laughs> now <clears throat> uh, we can just type a title for this up top, right? we could talk about uh, designing a game. Okay. What if we wanted to add a caption to the bottom? We could go to insert, grab a text box, see how I click it, and then I'm going to drag my hand along the bottom. You see that box appearing? I drag from the upper left to the lower right where I want the box to be, and then I start typing. <clears throat> and I'd say three or I'd, I could just say game designers work on a space simulation. Okay. Now if I didn't want it to sit like that, <clears throat> excuse me, I could click on my image, I could click on my text box, I could arrange them so they're centered, right, together. Then <clears throat> I could click on my text box alone and center the text. Now if I did if I thought it was too low I could drag it up, right? Get it a little closer, and there we go. Well that's how you enter it, insert an image and insert text. And an image is the same as a picture. Thanks everyone. I'm Dr. C. <clears throat> and let's see if we have anything else before we wrap up for this video. Oh, I could also insert an image within a two content and then have it aligned with my other text. And there we are. Thanks. Have a great day. <clears throat> and next time we will look at inserting some smart art and some other features. Bye-bye.